And then secondly, um, the president invited his son Hunter to the state dinner last night. Um, I'm wondering if you could take us into the thinking and decision making. Oh, no, 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 no. That is just cheap. Pa why uh, the president decided to invite I, his son. I'm just not going to get into family discussion, personal family discussion. As you know, Hunter is his son. I'm just not going to get into it. Oh, really? Let me ask you this. If, if Hunter Biden wasn't the president's son, would he have invited someone who had just reached a plea agreement with federal prosecutors well, two days earlier? Well, a couple of things. Again, that's his son. It's a, he's a family member. It is not uncommon for family members to, you know, I want to check your math on that one. to attend uh, events at the White House. You could look at past presidents. I'm sure you have. So that is not uncommon uh, as it relates to anything uh, uh, related to, uh, to energy crisis of the hunter. I'm just not going to respond to it from here. Can I follow up on that? Okay. Well, I just called in somebody. Go ahead. Yeah. So, but I mean, so exactly. You know it. Wait. Wait, what did you say? Curly wouldn't answer James's question, though. Are you going to answer the question? I mean, not, not a reasonable question to ask whether the President of the United States was involved, as this message seems to suggest, in some sort of a... Show is some freaky shit. ...coercive conversation for business dealing by a son. Is that something, if he wasn't, then maybe you should tell us. So here's... What did he say? 